guys, it's me, King Human, and <laughs> I got, <laughs> I got to laugh. I got, <laughs> okay, okay, this is good. I got a video reply from a guy. I usually don't watch him. I happen to, it's a long story. Okay, I don't want to digress because you know how I get. I'll go off into left field. I'm going off into left field now, and I'm talking about how much I don't want to go off into left field, and I'm in left field already. It's getting deeper and deeper. I'm way out there. Okay. No, I'm not on drugs. Anyway, I got a video reply from a guy. His name is Wizzy Waz. W-I-Z-E-E-W-O-Z. -E -E and I usually don't reply to these kind of things because I'm way too important and I don't have time and piss off. Anyway, he wrote me a letter and read it on camera and posted it as a video reply. So I want to read to you exactly what he wrote verbatim and, and address it. Because I get this a lot. That's the only reason I'm, I'm answering this. I tend to get it a lot. And it cracks me the hell up. So here we go. Okay, King Human. Remember, this is in his... He does it in a posh British accent. I'm not going to try and imitate him, but there you go. King Human, please tell me why you are trying to convince people that they should make money without actually contributing anything of value to society? Really? Dude, is that what I'm doing? I'm trying to contrive a, a situation where people can make money without contributing anything of value to society. How does that work? How does anybody actually do that? Because I live in a capitalistic society where people get paid for rendering goods or services. I don't know how you get paid for contributing nothing to society. I, I went through and I thought about my videos. I thought, well, th th is that video? Yeah, that contributes something. That contributes something. Every one of these things that I tell people to do is actually valuable to somebody. Otherwise, they wouldn't get paid. The only thing I could possibly think of that he could knock would be the video I did about the street performers in Vegas that stand there and they they work for tips. So they put on a gorilla outfit or whatever and they, they get their picture taken with somebody and the people give them tips. But that contributes. That's entertaining somebody. And these people aren't getting paid unless the person feels there's a value there because they're working strictly for tips. So I can't, I can't understand what you're talking about, Wizzy Waz. It may not be what you personally think is of value to society. That's a whole different issue. But the fact is, somebody in society thinks that that good or that service is valuable and they're willing to pay for it. Huh? Okay. <laughs> next, next paragraph. You're peddling all these crazy ideas. I'm peddling them? All these are crazy ideas about how to become rich quickly with zero evidence that you've made it work for yourself. Okay, first of all, I never put it out there that it's a get-rich-quick thing. In fact, if I've said it once, I've said it a million times. Money's not going to come down from the sky. Get off the freaking couch, quit eating Cheetos, and get to work. This is going to be work. I'm never saying, oh, this is so easy. You can sit on the couch eating Cheetos, and you're going to get rich very quickly by doing nothing. When have I said that? Uh, what are you, hard of thinking? I've done it. I've done everything from driving a truck to being a fine art broker to making money online. I've worked hard and I've worked smart. Smart is better. It's easier. But nothing is, there, there, nothing's a get rich quick thing. And I don't say that there is. Okay, what else do you say? Oh, uh, you promote it with the zero evidence that you made it work for yourself. Yeah. I'm not putting my proof of income out there because I'm not trying to sell you anything, you idiot. If I was trying to sell my book or my videotape series or whatever it was, 
then yes, I would probably have to say, look, this is how much I make doing this. But I'm not trying to sell anything, so I don't have anything to prove, you idiot. All I say is, I've done these things, I've made money, you give it a try, if it works for you, mazel tov. If it doesn't, piss off, I don't care. I mean, I'm an idiot. If I can make money doing these things, you can make money doing these things. Not everything is for everybody, but I'm not selling it. So shut up, <laughs> Wizzy Waz. Anyway, I get that one a lot. Prove how much money you make. What do you want me to do? Show you my car, show you my house, show you my, my travel, all that stuff? That's for those chumps that are out there actively trying to get you to buy their program. That's not me. That's not what I'm doing. So shut up. Again, I reiterated that. <laughs> oh, Skype call. Boo, boo, boo. Boo, boo, boo. Got to decline it. Emmanuel Rodriguez calling me on Skype. If you want to talk to me live on Skype, my handle is Calling King Human. And you can talk to me live. Yell at me, call me an idiot. <laughs> Come at me with this kind of shit. I don't care. Okay, uh, next. You're merely seeking YouTube attention, but I'm afraid appear to have nothing of value to offer in return. I'm seeking YouTube attention. No shit. I'm posting a video on YouTube. I'm seeking YouTube attention. Look, idiot. Anybody that posts a video on YouTube wants attention. They want views. That's why they're posting it. You think I'm going to post a video and then hope that nobody looks at it? Oh! Uh, I'm afraid you have nothing to offer of value in return. In return for what? You're watching my video? I don't care if you watch my video. What are you giving to me? Nothing. So piss off. Nothing to offer in return. If you don't like my videos, don't watch them. There's a clue. Ugh. What skills do you have? You must have some skills. Make good videos about how to make things, do things, create things. Add value to the world around us. Like I don't. Okay, first of all, Dude, don't tell me what kind of videos to make on my channel. You know, you have a channel. What kind of videos are you making? If I go to your channel right now, Wizzy Waz, W-I-Z-E-E-W-O-Z, -E -E and I look at the videos that you've made, are they going to fit the criteria that you're telling me to do? Or are you just a hypocrite? I don't know. I haven't gone and looked at your channel, but I'd be willing to bet. Uh, do videos about how to make things, do things, create things, add value to the world around it. I don't add value to the world around it. No. I've had people clean up rivers. I've had people donate blood. I've had people sign up to be organ donors. I've gotten people off of welfare. No, I don't do anything of value to society. I don't add value to the world around us. I do fucko, don't I? You idiot, you. I don't donate to charity. I don't do anything. What do you do, Wizzy Waz? I challenge you. What do you do? Now you give me proof. You show me how much you've donated to, to society. You show me how much you've donated to charity. You sh tell me what you do for a living. What is your job? And I will judge it. I will decide if it's a value to society or not. Because that's what you want to do. You want to decide for everybody what's a value of, to society and what isn't. Because everybody has to live by your standard. Yours is the one that, one that everybody has to abide by, obviously, from this. Because what you're saying is... You're the ultimate judge of what's of value to society and what isn't. I can't believe it, you know. People just don't see their own hypocrisy. And I get this all the time, and it cracks me up. Anyway, I just had to jump on and address this because my head was thromboing. And I love some of your thrombo comments on my previous video. Oh, by the way, uh, glasses, 
uh, given away in the previous video. This will be given, they will be given away in the next video. This is not a glasses giveaway, but eventually I will give these away too. I got a bunch of glasses to give away. I'm going to do one pair a week, maybe even more, who knows. Anyway, all right, I can't believe you watched this whole freaking video. 10 minutes and 17 seconds? Wow, you deserve something. All right, people. <laughs> Bye, Anara.